Hey guys, so here we are with Buffy season two of, no, I'm sorry, episode two of season four. <laughs> and um, in the last episode, <clears throat> they went to college and, um, I mean, the, the gang's all here except for Cordelia and Cordelia's over on Angel's side right now. So, um, Buffy and Willow are in college, Xander is not, um, and they had a vampire at the beginning, or not the beginning, but in the last episode that they, that she ended up defeating, ultimately, um, and at the end of the last episode, there was a vampire that got away, and, um, he then ended up getting attacked, and I'm assuming captured, um, by these guys, like, dressed in, like, military-looking night suit, night, um, vision stuff, and, like, they, they were all, te like, teched out, basically. Um, so, not sure what that means, but yeah, and then, and then in the beginning of, or, why do I keep saying beginning? Jeez. Um, in Angel, um, it was an introduction for their series, and, um, Basically, Angel is, like, pretty much going to become a PI, and Cordelia is helping them, and then they have a new guy with them. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, uh, if you want to check out this or that completely unedited or get early access for anything that I do, please feel free to check out my Patreon and the link in the description below. But, yeah, let's go ahead and jump into this episode. Wow, this music is so... Kathy is me. Oh my god, I would totally hang up a Celine Dion poster and listen to Cher. Oh goody. System, just log every call you make in here and that way when the bill comes it won't be a problem. What? Why is Kathy me? <laughs> I don't... Uh, I don't feel like I would be that bad though. Yeah, I, I was making my coffee and I just... Buffy, it's fine. I just wanted to make sure... Just gonna re replay it. Yep. So me. <laughs> well, here's where I get off. Say hey to Oz for me. Happy hunting. Wish me monsters. Uh. Yeah, they must have not had a choice for roommates. They can have good looking demons. So they always gotta be nasty looking. I mean, I get it, but. So you're coming along. You're not. This way you don't have to walk these spooky paths alone. It's <laughs> kinda Great. what you wanted. <laughs> oh, look at the, the stunt double, though. Like, it's so bad! I know, it's so. Like, I just say it in every episode, but it's so. It's. It's. It's own form of entertainment. God, and look at my sweater, it's ruined. Yeah, sorry about that. Here, we'll, we'll go get Except you Except for up. the fact that Kathy seems like an extrovert, and that's not me, but... Our likes are very much the same. Milstigia, Duraculon. Golavrika toka. Akva mir. You took your roommate patrolling with you? Well, I invited the whole dorm, but she was the only one that could make it. Eh. I told her I was Sarcasm. going for coffee, and she decided to tag along. Uh, it's a big day for me, actually. A friend of mine recently acquired a, an original Gutenberg demonography, and it suddenly occurs to me that you've never once asked me what my day's plans were, which would lead me to inquire whether you're feeling entirely yeah, yourself. It's bored. It's not mm -hmm. true. I ask about you all the time. Buffy, living with somebody is never easy, especially for an only child. Just listen to me, okay? When she sharpens her pencils, she measures them with a ruler to make sure they're all the same size. Which is fussy, I agree. OCD, okay. But everybody yeah. has their idiosyncrasies. You do well to learn to tolerate them. Oh, no. She's gonna go through her things. a big ass closet for a dorm. Why 
why doesn't she keep that stuff locked up? Come on, Buffy. I'm sorry, I just cut you. No, stay, stay. I'll watch your back. Uh-huh. Just pretty girl cuts in front of you. Not that I mind, but don't non-college guys usually populate the non-campus? Usually. Just thought I'd come around and check in my girls. And eat off my plate. What's the deal, Zand? Parents not feeding you? Sure they do. For a price. Yeah, so I was gonna say they spill. make them pay for it. What was that all about with the cutie patootie? Any vamp action? No. I did get jumped by a demon of non-specific origin last night. Yeah? Something apocalypsy? Do we need to assemble the Scooby Gang? I love that they keep calling it the Scooby Gang. I've multiple times heard them say Scooby Gang. It's been a little more there, Zand. Hi, everybody. Oh. Lord. Squeeze in. <laughs> you all know my roomie, Kathy. Hi. Hey, Kathy. Surely you kind of know when you're not wanted, right? I mean, I don't. I don't mean that to sound like bitchy, but. She is, uh, it's funny that Giles said something about only child and this is her first time sharing something with like basically a sister. This is definitely sibling like stuff right here. Don't forget to log those calls. I don't think I'm that bad. What? Who, who writes on their eggs? I mean, I guess you could do that because you don't eat the eggshells, but I've never seen them like, I've never seen anyone Sharpie their name on eggs before. No! Who left their gum here? <laughs> it wasn't me. It had to be somebody, Buffy. I don't know. <laughs> They'll eventually get along. It's totally a sibling thing. Well, although me and my siblings, my sister and I did not get along until after we stopped sharing things, so. Ew. Do you always make that noise when you sleep? You're the one that snores! There was like this monster, and he sat on me, and he did all this stuff to me. Stuff like scorpions and Bloody Mary minus the Mary? That's it. How'd you know? Well, I'm a good guesser. Uh... Me too. And I'm guessing that you need to be on your way to class, right, Kath? <clears throat> uh, you know what this means? Yes. Not only does she take my sweater, but now she has to horn in on my dreams. No, she is the most ever moved. Oh, the I dream haven't even with gotten you. to the floss. Buffy, focus, please. Oh, lucky love. Now, are they talking about Buffy or are they talking about Kathy? Because at first I automatically assumed it was Buffy, but maybe it could be Kathy who they're talking about? Madonna? Whitney? It's the guy that she was talking to! Hey, uh, I just stopped by to say <laughs> that. Uh, another time for sure. Bye, Kathy. Bye. See ya. Is he involved somehow? Into the evilness, the evil side. If I didn't do this shit with my sister. Your mm. problem is you're spoiled. Maybe the world revolved around you where you used to live, Shh. but it's shit. I think now. Buffy is a little bit huh? spoiled. Fine. They both have their things, though. She can drink it. Yep. Oh, and she's spilling it all over the place. Yeah, I can hang with her, watch for signs she's going over the edge. You're the best. Oh, she's probably patrolling by now. Check around the science center. If you need me, I'll be at the library. So her room, her roommate parties all the time. She's a crawling black cancer. She's other really bad things. 
So she's having anger problems. Is she clipping her fingernails or toenails? Toenails, of course it's it's always toenails. The slow mo. Ew. She's the clean freak, but yet she's clipping her toenails like just out and about. <laughs> I'm loving this episode. Oh god, eggs. And eggs are the worst. They'll smell of the room. But they are actually doing this stuff to them while they're sleeping. It's clear to me now. Good. That's better. Kathy's evil. I'm an evil fighter. It's simple. I'm gonna have to kill her. Oh. Yeah, they're definitely playing them against each other. Well, I would, but it's not just me in danger from Kathy. Look. Toenails. Evil toenails. Ew. Took them off the floor last night when she was in the bathroom. She Ew. thought I was asleep. Yep. Hopefully you use gloves. But you better show those bad puppies to Giles before you do anything. Just to be sure. Well, absolutely. I don't want to do anything crazy. Uh, you hurry on to Giles. I'll She's hang already done something crazy. She took her toenails. Great. Anybody home? What they need to do is, like, tie her up. Hello? And... <laughs> Ridiculous. Buffy, this oh. hurts me more than it hurts you. Not yet, but it will. Uh, sure. I sure not see that. I don't know about that. Uh, Buffy's going through something, yes, but I wouldn't put it past her to drop out or take off or something. Do something horrible to herself. Herself? Or worse. She's capable of it, you know. You can see it in those shifty little eyes of hers. Yeah, they need to do something with Kathy, too. Might push somebody too far. I mean, it's not fair to make you leave your own room. So, you're good. You just stay. Just right stay there. here. Yeah. Okay? Avoid the legs. Avoid the legs. She's gonna get him. Yep. Nope. Not tight enough. Oops. Look what I did. <laughs> Damn. Look what I did. What? Oh, nasty. Transdimensional demons involves the forced ingestion of animal blood while the victim slumbers. Of his nightmares. We're real. Look, I'm sorry, okay? Yeah, I left my dimension to go to college, and they sent these guys after me. What did I say in the last episode about Kathy potentially being supernatural? It's share time, Buffy. <laughs> oh, the fact that I compared myself to this chick. Fine. Then let's start with my sweater. Do you mind? People no. are trying to study. <laughs> She did like the window open. Windows open, happy? God knew that far. Who could have caught Victor Gordy? Got tripped my Ken. Eat taco or hot out gold, but nook, big no man. It was just like a version of her father or something. Left. See? There. Perfect. I was wondering why they weren't. Oh, well, I'm so glad you're here, Will. Roommates. I can already feel all that bad Kathy karma just draining away. I've always thought I was pretty easy going, you know? It's not like I have the big issues. I don't burn incense or. Are you gonna finish this? Yes. 
All right, so at least with them, they'll be more probably like sisters and what they're dealing with and everything. Um, <laughs> I knew in the last episode, Kathy was going to be some sort of supernatural thing. And then I kept comparing myself to her in this one. Although we still did have a lot of things in common, demon or not. But yeah, anyway. Um, I don't, I think this was probably a filler episode. I don't think that there was really anything to suggest, like, belonging to the main storyline, from what I could tell. Um, but yeah. Anyway, uh, if you want to check out this episode completely unedited or get early access for the next one, please feel free to check out my Patreon and the link in the description below. And if you will for me, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode.